Hello guys, so as you guys might have heard about it, OpenAI released ChatGPT4 which was a huge trending topic on social media for the past few days and still is and guess what, today I got access uh, to the GPT4 API and this means now I can show you how you can uh, code GPT4 to be a customer support agent for your website like we did in our previous video but as you might remember in the previous video we used GPT 3.5 turbo but instead this time we're gonna use chat GPT 4 so as you can see the GPT 4 model is quite advanced uh, in terms of uh, solving more complex reasoning situations uh, but uh, OpenAI says that for many basic tasks uh, the GPT-4 and GPT-3.5 models are not significantly different uh, but let's go ahead and see how we can use GPT-4 in our chat application again the most of the site's code remains unchanged uh, we use the uh, arrays uh, to create a conversation history and allow ChatGPT to respond to these conversations in a more uh, in a more uh, adequate manner and uh, the only thing we change in our code from the previous video so this is the events.js file uh, where we uh, fire the ev where the event gets fired whenever someone sends a chat message via Wix chat and this is the OpenAI file so your key goes here and in our previous video model was GPT 3.5 turbo but instead of that this time we are putting the model as GPT 4 alright so let's go ahead and actually test this to see how it goes so just to summarize uh, we are still a bikini store and uh, we, we will go ahead and have a decent conversation with chat gpt right now hey my name is sean and actually the wait my name is james and i want to buy a bikini for my girlfriend now in this video we're gonna test if chat gpt4 remembers our conversation and replies appropriately can you help and we give it a few seconds for the and there you have it so uh, i've set up wix chat in such a way so that uh, the image is displayed of is of a person and the name on the chat is of a person so that uh, the user that is interacting with you thinks that uh, they are talking to a uh, actual person of course you can change it and make it a different if you wish that's up to you so OpenAI replied I mean chat GPT4 replied with hello James I'd be happy to help you find the perfect bikini for your girlfriend to get started can you please provide me with some information uh, such as her size preferred style and color preferences this will help me recommend the best options for her now we're going to test out if Ch uh, open ai sorry chat gpt4 remembers our conversation so uh thanks uh her size is 38 no actually 38 is too too big sorry 28 28 and uh, she likes the color pink do you, can you recommend a bikini si uh, style okay uh, we'll have to probably wait a few seconds because uh, chat gpt4 api is a little slower than 3.5 but this is uh, normal because the demand for 4 is much much higher and uh, even on the chat like on the actual chat where you go and interact with chat gpt4 they are uh, reducing the amount of messages we can send every hour so i'm just gonna pause the video over here and i'll turn it on once i get a reply 
and there you have it so it took a uh, more than a few seconds for GPT-4 to reply so at least we know that the GPT-4 API is a bit slow but that is that is totally um, understandable because uh, chat GPT is restricting uh, is uh, seeing a lot of traffic for GPT-4 and they're actually downsizing on the amount of calls we can make per hour even on the chat so it makes sense the API is a bit slow so GPT-4 replied with of course based on her size and color preference I would recommend our popular pink mm -hmm, popular pink triangle bikini okay this is interesting uh, it features adjustable ties on both the top uh, and bottom ensuring a comfortable fit for your girlfriend the triangle top provides a flattering shape while the classic bikini bottom offer you can find this bikini website triangle bikinis wow okay 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 that is quite that's good okay uh, i just wanna i just wanna test this uh, uh okay um do you remember my name okay, so let's see if chat gpt4 actually remembers the name that i had put and yes your name is james if you have more questions so you can see that the conversation actually works so gpt4 is taking into account all the messages that we have sent before let's ask another question cool uh, do you have a URL for your triangle bikini uh, products L now this is a little complicated because I'm not given much uh, to chat GPT but let's see it's chat GPT 4 let's see what it responds I haven't given a lot of information regarding URLs and uh, website uh, in the initial system message so it's gonna be interesting to see what chat gpt oh, oh oh okay okay this is interesting this is really interesting so gpt replied with absolutely you can find our collection of triangle bikinis including the pink triangle bikini i mentioned earlier by visiting this link so https bikini dot store slash collections slash triangle bikinis feel free to browse and it is url feel free to browse through the options and let me know if you have any happy shopping so this is interesting how chat gpt was able to come up with the url bikini dot store because in our initial system message we tell chat gpt that our support team's url is bikini dot stores slash support so i think it just uh, it made a logic that if the base URL is like this what's going to be the uh, collection URL for our triangle bikinis and it was pretty not far away because if you set up a website uh, basically you would have your of course base URL then if you have a collection slash collections and then the name of the items so that's pretty pretty cool so this is how we can uh, set up chat GPT-4 with Vix chat so let me know if you guys want to see more of these videos and maybe in the next video I'm gonna walk away from uh, the Vix chat integration try to integrate chat GPT with some other vertical of Vix catch you guys in the next video see you